Today we're, we're launching a coalition of business leaders, uh, elected officials, and nonprofit and university leaders across the state of Florida uh, you know, in support of, uh, of immigration reform. We know how important uh, to every country that the borders need to be protected, that we have a regular process of immigration, and a legitimate process of, of immigration. The President-elect Trump made, made immigration reform and, and securing the border an important issue. And we're hopeful that President Trump will, will take action, but we'll take action in a thoughtful way. As mayor of the city of Hialeah, a city that was made by immigrants, we understand, we live day to day, the issue of immigration. Securing our borders has to be a top priority. This is something that I think everybody agrees on. Mass deportation is not acceptable. We believe that mass deportations, the deporting millions of people, would be destabilizing to our economy and, and would just destabilize communities, so we're against that. There's 11 million people, and most of us are hardworking people looking for a better way of life that are in this country. We have to find a way to identify and give these people the ones that have no criminal history, that have had no trouble with the law, an opportunity to be part of our country. If you've been here and your only violation was overstaying your visa and you've been making positive contributions to the city of Hialeah, to Tallahassee, to Orlando, we should deal with you in a thoughtful way. Today is the beginning of that. Myself as the mayor of Hialeah, uh, as part of the U.S. Conference of Mayors, I'm going to be pushing this message to all those mayors throughout the country to unite us, those congressmen, those senators that are going to be helping us when it comes to immigration.